All right, we're back. Earlier in the show, Selena took us through the presidential suite at the Chateau Lafayette at <laughs> Nemecolon Woodlands Resort and Spa <laughs> in the Laurel Highlands. It was a real treat. And if you're looking for a winter escape, Nemecolon is a wonderful destination to travel to because it's right in our backyard. It's an easy drive to get there. But Selena, you did more than just check into the hotel. Oh, I did. I did a lot of stuff. And you guys know I love to eat. Eating is one of my favorite activities. And I love dining out, especially at five star five diamond restaurants like Le Trek, which is located inside of the Chateau at Nemecolon. I think that that's the cool thing about this restaurant. It has a personality. It has a story. Legendary Le Trek, the renowned restaurant at Nemecolon Woodlands just received another Forbes five-star award. That's the 13th year in a row for the best service and facility in the world. I think the biggest thing is that we, we want to give amazing service. And then the awards kind of just happened because we were focused on giving amazing service. Johnstown native Kristen Butterworth honed her culinary skills in kitchens across the U.S. and Italy before returning to rural PA to reinvent a dining experience like no other. Immediately you'll be greeted with the champagne cart uh, where we have multiple different types of champagne that will come to the table. From there you can choose your cocktails if you pass on the champagne, but why would you pass on bubbles? She's right. Why not have both? This cocktails are Smoke and Mirrors, Market Alley Gin, Butterfly Pea Syrup, and Lemon Juice. Ooh, that was the coolest thing I've ever seen. We also have caviar options, uh, a whole oh. loaf of sear foie gras that you can choose to oh. have before you even start your meal. Then from there, that's, that's kind of showtime for us. You, you now have a red envelope on the table, a feather plume pen. You're invited to open it up at that point. You'll find in the envelope a letter from myself explaining the experience and then a page with pictures on it where you can choose what you'd like to have. Circle 10 items from the illustrated list, all part of the Leap of Faith menu. Is it possible to circle dessert twice? So every person in the dining room has a different experience based off of what they chose on that paper. What we have here is our beet salad. So it's a beet panna cotta. I have never eaten beet salad that looked or tasted like this. Oh my, what do we have here? So this is our truffle tagliatelle. Uh, it's a homemade egg yolk pasta with confit egg yolk on top, shaved truffle, a Vermont butter sauce, and shaved Parmigiano Reggiano. When describing food that is indescribably delicious. I'm speechless. <laughs> uh, so this is our cheese course in honor of Mr. Hardy. So if you know him, he always has a cigar. That's delicious. Next, the Pièce de Résistance, a delectable dessert to die for. It has a frozen clarified vanilla granita on it, and it's just, it's, it's creamy and, and citrusy, and it's just a really cool dessert. A play on the London Fog tea drink, it has a smoky lavender scent that is poured table side, and smelling it before you taste it is all part of the experience. Seven, eight, nine courses later. Oh my goodness. The candy cart? Uh, I couldn't help myself. <laughs> and you wouldn't be able to either, trust me. Now, if the Leap of Faith menu is too daring for you, choose your own meal from the fixed priced menu. But if you want that mind blowing dining destination, you got to get away to La Trec and Nemecolon in Woodlands. It is world class right in our backyard. And a big thanks to Nemecolon for sponsoring our Operation Destination Getaway. It was so amazing. Okay, oh. we have to talk about this because you don't like beets. You didn't think you liked caviar. Yep, and I didn't tell them that. When they no. brought the beet salad out, I, I said, you know, this looks great. In my beets, they're the one thing that I don't like. That was the best beet I have ever <laughs> eaten I'm in so my proud life. I'm you because I love beets. I, I, David, I, yeah. you would have loved I, I'm it. I'm so happy. And the <laughs> caviar, too. You were on board. Caviar is my new thing. It's my jam. I love it. Yeah, I destroyed that. Jam. And you said the dessert was really one of the best desserts you've ever had. I'm, I'm not even exaggerating when I say that. It was the best dessert I have ever eaten in my life. Wow. That's enough. It was, That's no. enough for me to want to go. It was good. To see the looks on your face. And then you had enough room because you knew it was going to be good to take something off the car. Always enough love room. Love it. Well done, Selena. So 